know some booties in Cali, they all be calling me daddy. I know some hoes out in Texas, they all be showing affection. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you are new, do yourself a favor, subscribe, hit that bell notification, come join the team, cause we get in baddies over here. All right, today's video, she's coming back soon. A lot sooner than you thought, bruh. Now you might have thought, you know what I mean? I'm in no contact. It's gonna take a long, long time. It might be a year. Hey, low key it might. But I'm here to reassure you that if you're doing no contact the correct way, the time will be a lot shorter. If you're doing everything right, you're doing no contact, you're leveling up your life, you're making all the right moves, some gonna trigger your baddie to come back to daddy. You know what I'm saying? Get a cheeks clap. Um, I've been talking to a lot of you guys on Zoom. If you have not booked one, link in the description, book you a call. But a lot of you guys have been telling me all these success stories about how your girl is coming back and what do you do next and this and that. Told you, told you so. Yeah, man. Look, man, the techniques and the strategies work. You just gotta implement them. You gotta stick to them. The hardest part is having that discipline to do the right thing. Because sometimes I even tell you guys certain things to do and then you go and remix it and do your own thing and then be wondering, bro, it work? Cause I didn't tell you to do that. Get it together, come on. Anyways, man, if, you, if you're doing all the right things, you know, you're doing no contact, you're, you're leveling up every single day, you're working on yourself, you're in the gym, you're grinding, you started your business, you're working at that, you're hanging out with your friends, you're going out, you're meeting new baddies, Clapping new cheek, you know what I'm saying? Leveling up your life, your life is lit. You're posting it on social media. You will trigger something in her to question, well, well, well where is the guy? Well, oh wait, that's where he's at. He's over there doing this, there and that, traveling here, traveling there, grinding here, grinding there, glowing up. She see your new physique. She see, you know, the glow all over your face. You shining, bruh. And that's why I tell you guys it's very important to have a skincare routine. And that's why I'm excited to have Teach Hanley as a sponsor of today's video. Teach Hanley simplifies the process of taking care of your skin. They provide you with all the products you need and nothing you don't. Seriously, I still don't think some of you believe me when I tell you how much implementing a quality skincare routine will improve your confidence in all aspects of your life. I recommend you start with the level one one system which comes with all the basics. Boom, a daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, an AM moisturizer with SPF 20, and a PM moisturizer. And to make things dead simple for you guys, they provide this instruction card that comes in every box that tells you when to use each product, how much to use, and in what order. It definitely comes in clutch. But you don't have to take my word for it, they have over 7,000 five-star reviews from satisfied customers all over the globe. In addition to amazing skin, members of Teach Handling get tons of benefits, including at least 20% off retail price, access to exclusive monthly deals, pause or cancel at any time, and free US shipping. And because Teach Hanley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering you guys a great deal. Just click the first link in the description and get 30% off your very first box plus a free gift. So don't miss out on this amazing deal. Click the first link and get started today. But yeah, man, the timeline as far as when she's going to come back after you implemented everything I've told you, it's gonna speed up. It's gonna speed up. You know why? Because a lot of these women aren't used to men treating them this way. You are a part of the select few, my brother. The select few that decided to watch this type of content, go out of their way, study it, read the eBooks, take the masterclass, book the Zoom calls, focus on yourself, put yourself first, prioritize getting better at game, knowing and understanding women and how they move and their psychology. You're ahead of the pack. So with that being said, yeah, the other dudes, they might get their girl back in a certain amount of time, but guess what? We're on an expedited time right now. So I'm here to calm your nerves, ease your nerves, right? Make you feel like, okay, I got this. I just gotta stick to it. Just gotta do what Mr. tells me to do. Stop checking her social media. This is one thing that I noticed a lot of you guys struggle with. Checking her social media, checking up on her, seeing what she's doing, seeing if she's leveling up or, or found another dude, leveled up her, her roster. She got a whole bunch of dudes that's just balling and now you feel like you're a loser. Now why would you even put yourself in that predicament? No matter who she's with or who she's talking to, because we all know women, especially if they baddies, they got options doesn't affect you. You know who you are, you know what you have to offer. Then it's just gonna be this comparison game and you're just gonna be stressing yourself out for no reason. I'm telling you, all that really don't matter. Yeah, it's good if you're a successful, leveled up dude in life, but guess what? There's always gonna be someone with more money, 
someone handsomer, someone with bigger muscles. You know what I mean? There's always somebody that has something that you do not have, so you don't want to start playing that game. So checking up on her social media is just going to stress you out because then you're going to start overthinking. But you have to remember that these dudes that have something that you don't, you have something they don't. You know what I mean? They're, they're, no one's perfect. No one's perfect in life. Yeah, they might have a lot of money, but no game. Might have a fast car, but they're lame. Born personality. She was with you for a reason. So look at your positive characteristics. Write down things that you know that she liked see how you can double down and work at those things and become better like if you were funny become funnier go out with your friends crack more jokes if she liked how you were muscular get more muscles if she liked how you were caring for other people care even more for more people whatever it is you know how to cook cook better if you don't know how to cook learn how to cook so then when she come back she's like oh my god you can't cut this is no yeah, you're missing out, baby. <laughs> Stop paying the building. You over here splashing and dashing. You know what I mean? With all the flavor and the seasoning and stuff. Got baddies coming through, giving them gourmet meals and gourmet D. Piping them. Laying it down properly. <laughs> now, she's, she's missing out, man. She's telling all her friends, I think I made a mistake. He's living his best life. He's doing his thing. I also miss his smell. Whenever I come over, he had that magnetic by Misty Best Smelling Cologne for under $100. He got it before it was gone. <sighs> um, yeah, so she's going to start to slowly breadcrumb you. And, and the, the timing is going to be a lot faster than you expected. So you gotta be ready, you gotta stay ready. Hit me up for a call if you need some advice on what do I do next, you know what I mean? She hit me up, she's saying she misses me, she's interested, but now I need a plan of action. It's best if I know your specific situation because I can give you general advice, but sometimes that might not work for you. Or you might interpret it a certain way, all right? And then just go on, just do your own thing. It's not what we're here for, all right? We're here for leveling up, making the right moves, the right decisions. Stay strong with your no contact because you know, you might see something and it might trigger you to just let me just reach out a lot of you guys try to justify breaking no contact as much as possible like well you know what if i just keep a cordial friendship you don't want to be your friend stop saying that you want to be your friend because you don't want to be your friend if you want to be your friend then be your friend don't clap cheeks and don't get mad at me why don't you want to be more to friends i use the the, the friend way to get into the cheeks and to a relationship you don't work like that she will categorize you as just a friend. Even if you are friends with benefits, guess what? She'll start to slowly take the benefits away because you're going to start thinking that you're in a relationship. You're going to start catching feelings, being a sucker, being beta Billy instead of Alpha Andy. She's like, ugh. He, he ain't going to just keep it cool and just ugh, clap cheeks. You want more? You want to do all this extra stuff? Start trying to take her out, wine and dine her and stuff. Nah, man, you was just friends, right? You was just friends. But nah, she's gonna come back around, man, and uh, try to get back in your life. But do, do not, do not bite at the bait when it first is thrown at you. Play it cool. Keep doing what you have been doing this entire time to reattract her into your life. Don't go back to the old ways. Then you won't get the same results, and that's just gonna be this never ending cycle. You lose her, you get her back. You lose her, you get her back. You know what I mean? We don't want that. We want to get her, we want to maintain it, and we want to be in the power position of whether or not we want to even keep her in our life. Anyways, that is it for the video for today. If you guys liked it, please do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button down below. Also down below, download Attraction Made Easy Masterclass, book you a one-on-one -on -one Zoom call. And until next time, focus on you and the women will too. I know some beauties in Cali, they all be calling me daddy. I know some hoes out in Texas, they all be showing the face.